right, good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to the Pink in the Rink 2020 kickoff. Alison Payne and the team at the Peterborough and District Branch of the Canadian Cancer Society have discovered the fountain of fundraising in their partnership with the Peterborough Peets. And based off the experience they've had with the Peterborough community, they don't expect the well to go dry anytime soon. Maybe five years ago, but not anymore. It's such a well-known event in town. I mean, normally after 10 years, things do start to slow down, and they're not at all. So uh, we're going to keep going as long as the community will have us and, and the Peets will have us. It's, it's a great event. The event brings the best out of the Peterborough community, and each time around, community members with close ties to the Peets are appointed as co-chairs to lead the fundraising effort. This year, former Peets Mike Martone and Ian Armstrong held the co-chair title each with their own connections to the effects of cancer. Yeah, you know what, I think it's just, uh, you know, they're reaching out with someone who had connections with uh, the local OHL team here at the Peets, and, uh, and uh, you know, I played here for four years. Um, it, it is a great cause. Um, you know, we are raising money for an extremely unfortunate uh, situation that, that, you know, kids, women, you know, uh, elders, you know, it, I mean, it doesn't matter who it is who we're helping out. We just want to... Uh, you know, help out, uh, you know, knock out cancer, like I said. Um, you know, I had a little girl in my uh, neighborhood named uh, Neve Alderson. Uh, she actually goes to my school as well. Um, she's a cancer warrior. And, uh, you know, she's going to help me with this uh, fundraising initiative as well at the school and, and outside the school. So, uh, you know, it's not just women's cancer. It's, uh, you know, cancer in the youth. And uh, it it's all falls under the same umbrella, and we're here to knock it out. Uh, it was overwhelming because, uh, um I wasn't really demonstrating very few symptoms, if at all, but I was really fortunate that, uh, with both Dr. Hughes and Dr. Fuoco uh, to identify the cancer so rapidly and get me into proper care in Toronto. So with that, um, this is just one small way to get back, both to the community, health community, uh, the Peterborough Health community, excuse me, Dr. Hughes and Dr. Fuoco and their staff, uh, their colleagues at the Peterborough Regional Health Center, um, and also as a former player, it, it's a wonderful cause and I, and I hope I can do justice to my predecessors. Another game dedicated to those who have battled and the ones who continue to fight. Here's to Pink in the Rank.